praise the lord a very good morning to you a very good morning to you too god bless you amen amen my dear brothers and sisters we welcome you again to the continuation we were talking about the stress in our lives and how to combat stress first day he explained to you what happiness and joy is second day he gave you a solution about taking the word of god as joshua was told today and get rid of worry and get rid of worries yes and get rid of worries today is the next step this is the next step and which is going to tell us how we are going to combat that in another form yes so today i am going to read philippians 4 6 yes in everything not for everything in everything in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your request be known be made known to god god praise god Praise so God. He's praise God. In everything, not for everything. everything. What's the difference between in everything and for everything? Now I cannot thank God, or I cannot pray to God, Lord. I am praying to you, and I thank you for cancer that you gave me. Yeah. Now please understand, God never gave you that cancer. Cancer. Correct. Sickness does not come from God. God. Yeah. It comes from the devil. Right. Now you say, how do you say that? Hmm. Because Acts ten thirty eight says, God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with Holy Spirit and with power. so that he went about doing good and healing all who were oppressed by the devil for god was with him amen amen okay. amen yes so that sickness does not come from god it has come from the devil and jesus said the thief comes to steal kill and destroy, and destroy but i have come to give you life life, life in abundance, abundance. so you. when god said do not be anxious means he saying get those negative thoughts out of you yes So when God tells you to remove something negative, He also tells you to fill that vacuum which you have removed with something. Correct. So He's saying, I want you to pray, praise and pray to God in everything. Correct. Pray, pray in everything. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. So, so in other words, He's saying, I want you to bring everything before the Lord. Now, when a person is worried, the whole day he's stressed out. Correct. So he say I have no time. But now when he has let go of the worry, yes. He has got plenty of time. Correct. So now when he is th- praising God. Mm-hmm. Now, praise gets you into connection with God. God. Amen. Okay? Amen. It it builds up your relationship with God. God yes. It gets you right into the position and now when you are praising God, there is fullness of joy in the presence of, of God. The Lord. Now your capacity to receive from god yes. begins to multiply correct praise god praise god so, praise so god when a person is saying i do not have time for worry a time to pray yeah when worry goes out he has got plenty of time to pray praise god correct praise god praise and god and also to praise god in everything yes so today the lord is giving you an instruction stop worrying and start praising and praying to god Please, in god. everything now prayer is you asking god to intervene in your life exactly yes how many a times brother i want to ask you supposing your son fell down yes and you saw him yeah will you stand here or will you run i'll run you'll run yeah. then why is it god not running to catch us when we fall, fall. because genesis 126 says that god said let us make man in our likeness and image, image yes. and let them have dominion yeah, correct. so even though the earth belong to god right he loves man that he says from now on man i give this dominion to you you so if god is to interfere in our affairs he cannot do that because he by his own word has limited himself by saying this earth belongs to you right so for god to intervene he needs me to issue the license so prayer is when i have got a relationship with god, god. and saying god i cannot carry out this uh, uh transaction that you have given me correct but i need your help yes that's why when angel gabriel came he had to ask mother mary whether she was willing to agree with god god okay. correct correct when she said i am the handmaid of the lord lord yes yeah. only then everything happened. happened yeah so in the same way when you understand my friend the power that is there in your mouth and you open your mouth and you talk to god and you open your mouth and tell him in everything 
give him praise and thank him and ask him to intervene in your life i tell you the whole of heaven opens up god backs you up and he will turn that battle into victory amen and that's why he is giving you an instruction and he's saying listen i want you to pray to god in everything right in everything let your request be made known to god god amen hallelujah, hallelujah. and when you make it request known to god make it with a thankful heart Praise not god. with worry but with rejoicing so heavenly father in the name of jesus i not only rebuke that fear that worry yes, but i speak a lot that with this new understanding in everything we your people will ask you to intervene in our lives and right now we ask you almighty god to intervene in everybody's life for you know their needs and i pray father in the name of jesus that all their needs be met right now not according to our riches but according to your riches in glory through christ jesus amen as you open your mouth and speak the prayers in everything remember the thief comes to kill steal and destroy jesus came to give you life life in abundance yes, Lord. so don't you ever thank god for because not everything comes from god, god. it comes from the devil as well yes, but in everything even though the devil has made a mess you can ask god to intervene in that mess and god's power will empower you to destroy the works of satan thank you thank you jesus praise you jesus this is really beautiful now we know the power of prayer as well so we ask god to intervene here the third part is over thank you brother god we'll come back again tomorrow yes. and with the next part so, of so it so the quick revision what is joy and happiness right to do not be anxious correct three in everything prayer in prayer everything. is very powerful amen it connects you into a relationship with, with god. god amen amen so thank you we'll continue with the thank third. you very much you all have a great day oh, god yeah. bless you a victorious day a blessed day. day amen amen see you nothing broken nothing missing in your life, life. in jesus name amen amen, amen. amen. thank you thank you i will sing yes i will pray even in my darkest time through the sorrow and the pain